Good morning, boys and girls. Today is April 13th, 2020. We will begin our spelling and high frequency words lesson for this week. Our lesson objective. I can practice my spelling and high frequency words for the week. Spelling focus is A-R, which makes the sound R like a pirate. The focus sound of this week is R, like in the word car and like in the word star. Our focus spelling for the sound R is A-R. Anytime we hear the sound R in a word, we will spell it with A-R. Again, let's look at the word car, K-R, right? So it's C. A R. Let's look at the word star. St R. St R. S T A R. Okay, are you guys ready? Okay, let's get started. Help me read the word that is on the screen. Let's do it by sounds and then we'll blend it together. Notice how in the middle you see in red the letters A and R. We just learned that AR makes what sound? Excellent job, R. Right, so let's go ahead and read the word. D. R. K. D. R. K. What's the word? Dark. Very good. Let's read the next word. Y. R. D. Let's do the sounds one more time. Y. R. D. What's the word? Yard. Right? Yard. Notice how in the middle we hear the R sound and it's spelled A R. Y R D. Yard. Help me write the word hard. Let's do all the sounds first. R D. Hard. What is the first sound you hear in the word hard? What letter makes a h sound? H. R. How do I spell R? Very good. A R. R D. How do we write D? D. Very good. So what is the word? Hard. Let's write the word start. Start. What's the first sound we hear? S. S. Very good. S. T. 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 S. T. S. T. R. A. R. S. T. R. T. Very good. What is the word? St art. Start. Let's do the word park. What is the first sound you hear in park? P -p. Very good. P -r. How do I spell R? Very good. A R P R. K, very good. P arc. What's the word? Park. Awesome job helping me spell words with the R sound. So right now I'm going to show you the words for this week. These are your spelling words. Notice how all of the words are going to have the R sound, right? A R R.
This is the word hard. Read it with me. Hard. This is the word start. Read it with me. Start. Where does start have the R sound? In the beginning, the middle, or the end of the word? In the middle, nice. This is the word park. Say the word park. This is the word farm. Read the word farm. This is the word sharp. Read the word sharp. This is the word yard. Read the word yard. This is the word dark. Read the word dark. This is the word part. Read the word part. This is the word arm. Read the word arm. This is the word art. Read the word art. Nice job, boys and girls. So now I'm going to show you the high frequency words for this week. We are in unit eight, week one. Now we will read our high frequency words for this week. We are in unit eight, week one. I will show you the words, I will read the words, and then I will ask you to read the word with me. These words are words that you should be able to read in a snap. We will be practicing them all week. Remember, these words will not have our pattern of the week, which is AR, but these are words that we should know how to read in a snap because we find them all over our books. Ready? Okay, let's get started. Okay, this is the word boy. Can you think of a sentence with the word boy? Hmm. For example, the boy likes to play soccer with his friends. Boy. This is the word city. Can you think of a sentence with the word city? There are lots of buildings in our city. This is the word for. Can you think of a sentence with the word for? I have four cookies in my tray. This is the word great. Can you think of a sentence with the word great? I have a great time teaching my students. This is the word would. Can you think of a sentence with the word would? I would love to go hiking this weekend. This is the word your. Can you think of a sentence with the word your? Your costume is amazing. This is the word it's. It's. Can you think of a sentence with the word it's? The penguin eats its breakfast. This is the word sing. Can you think of a sentence with the word sing? I like to sing while I cook. All right, boys and girls, so these are the high-frequency words of the week. You will be practicing them all week. 
Next, I'm going to show you a slide of the activities that you will be doing for shared reading. You will have two shared reading texts. The first one you will use for Monday and Tuesday. On Monday, you will read the text three times for fluency, just like we did in the classroom. And then you will find at least 10 high frequency words. Then on Tuesday, you will come back to the video, read the text three times again for fluency. But now you will be finding all the words with our focus spelling and sound pattern AR. Once you have found all of them and written them down, you will answer the following prompt. Would you like to spend a night looking at stars? Why? Why would you like to? Or why would you not? Okay, so this is the shared reading that we will use for Monday and Tuesday. Ready? Let's read it together. Begin. A star party. It's dark. Can we start? Carla asked. Carla was having a star party with her friends at the farm. They would look at stars through Mom's telescope. Yes, let's go, Mom said. Outside, far away from city lights, Carla and her friends looked at the sky. They saw many stars. Then they looked through the telescope. One star was big and bright. Mom told them it was a planet not a star. It was Mars. Let's call it a sky party, Carla said. Now you're going to pause the video and read it three times. Okay. Once you're done, since today is Monday, you will be looking for at least 10 high frequency words. Okay. When you're ready, Go ahead and push play so I can show you what else are we going to do. Awesome job. All right. So now we're going to go over our shared reading part two. This is what you will do Wednesdays and Thursdays, but you'll do it with a different test. Te oh. But you'll do it with a different text. On Wednesday, you will read the text three times for fluency and you will find at least 10 high frequency words. Then on Thursday, you will come back to the video. You will pause it and read the text three times for fluency. You will find all the words with the AR sound or spelling pattern. And then you will write about one thing you learned about Mars. Let me show you the shared reading that we will use for part two. This is our shared reading for Wednesday and Thursday. This text is about Mars. Let's go ahead and read it. Ready? Begin. On Mars. Mars is millions of miles away from us. A kind of robot called a rover is on Mars now. It is sending pictures and information back to scientists on Earth. The rover is a machine, but in some ways it seems alive. It can move. It has eyes that are cameras and an arm that can pick up rocks. The rover's body holds many important parts and its brain is a computer. So on Wednesday and Thursday, you will come back to this video, you will pause it here, and you will read it three times. On Wednesday, you will look for at least 10 high frequency words. On Thursday, you will read the text three times for fluency, and then you will circle a word that has the same R sound as farm. Now I'm going to ask you to pause the video and copy down all the words. The first words are your spelling words. Let's read them. Hard, start, park, farm, sharp, yard, dark, part, arm, 
art. The purple words are your high frequency words. These are the words that you should learn to read in a snap. Okay, let's read them. Boy, city, for, great, would, your, it, sing. Okay. Remember, this is your word work. Every day, you will come back and decide which activity you're going to use with your spelling words. Okay, you're going to use the words that have the A-R for these activities. You could do the rainbow words. You could do sentences with each word. You could choose to do the sailboat words. You could picture it. You could do the ABC order, or you could color code the words. Remember, you only need to do one word activity per day. Okay? All right, boys and girls, I'll see you soon. Have a nice day.